what's up, you know, boy, you know, it's possible, or, you know, boy, in this video, I don't know what I'm talking about, I'm just gonna talk, um, like, a uh, video, diary, journal, basically, just what's on my mind, um, this past week, I started recording again, as you can see from the other videos, and, like around a month ago, started going to the gym again. Um, today, I'm at 101.9 pounds of skeletal muscle. I went from 94 pounds to that. So I put on mostly all my muscle again. I have two more pounds of muscle I gotta put on. Um, my body fat's down to eight point six percent I think I'm not for sure it's eight point four percent um so I'm getting further down into the sub digits um a little bit more to go and I'll be pretty freaking uh shredded but yeah um doing these videos again and getting back in the gym feels good makes me feel like i'm doing something you know that i enjoy and that i enjoy that i also can like make progress in i guess you know and um yeah so i'm gonna try to keep making these videos every other day at least I didn't make a video for the past two days because I got sick and then after I got sick um, I wanted to take a couple days to recover because I was working myself pretty hard I have a video that I'm gonna upload probably before this one where it's just like talking about rest and that's the point of the video I'm just gonna title this video random or something I don't know um, but yeah, I feel pretty happy um, with the results I've been getting. I've been consistently putting on half a pound of muscle every single day. I think it's just because of a mixture of things. Um, I have like newbie gains again because I didn't work out for four months. I have my muscle memory and I've been eating a pretty strict diet. Um, uh, you know, no, I'm doing keto. So it's high fat, low carbs, um, moderate protein. Like I still get like 200 grams of protein, so it's more than a gram per pound of body weight. Cause I weigh today is that I weighed 191. The highest I weighed, like with more water weight, was like 195 ish, or maybe like around 196. Um, but I have eaten carbs the past couple of days. So if you guys don't know. Um, when you eat carbs, like, if you don't have them for a long time, uh, at least this is how it is for me, and that's what I've heard, it, you, like, swell up, kind of, like, uh, your cells use different things for energy, like glucose, and, I, I don't know, I can't explain it, I don't understand, but, yeah, you just, you look bigger, kind of, so, yeah, I, um, way more I feel like because I've been at carbs for the past couple days um but we'll see um I'm trying not to say um so much because I, I had to go through like uh the last video the video before like two videos before and I said like um like fucking like 40 50 times so I was like editing it out because like um 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 but yeah, so I'm just working on getting better at this, uh, <laughs> getting these videos out, I want to try to make them 10 minutes per video, uh, so what I was doing before, but just getting back in is kind of harder, you know, doing the full 10 minutes, but I'm going to be doing these videos, I want to try to do different types of videos too, maybe I'll start making content on like working on and stuff, like even though I work out quite a bit um I don't really have like um 
a passion for it, I guess, as far as, like, making videos about it 100%, but, like, I will, because I, I, I think I could, it's just I've never done it, you know, but it's not something that, like, I really care about too much, I guess, like, I just kind of do it for myself, just for, like, it's just fun, because, like, uh, you get to, like, work on something, I guess, that you can see progress in. Um, but yeah, I'll probably start making some videos about just like what I do, and this and that, if any of you guys want to, uh, see different stuff on it. I'm already making one video right now, which is Road to 4% Body Fat, um, and I know that sounds crazy. Maybe these machines are off, um, on the, in body scan and shit, cause like, but I... I do hold a lower body fat percentage easier, but uh, you can see right here, 4.2%, uh, and that was when I was at 165, so that's the lowest body fat percentage I've ever had. I think I had like in total like 7 pounds of fat on my body or some shit, um, but like right now, I'm at an 8%. I, I think that the BMI, or not the BMI, but the in body scores, I don't think they're that accurate. So when I was at 4% body fat, I was probably something at like 8, and like I'm probably at something like 12 now. So I'm just going off of like what that is. But I, I don't know. Maybe they are accurate. Who's to say? But if so, like, goddamn, boy, it's shredded as fuck. I'd show a picture um, on my phone, but I'm using my phone. But maybe I could edit it, a picture in of what my physique was at that time but yeah that was pretty cool because at that point I was only working out for like a few months like it was like a month and a half and I worked out before uh like I'm going to say I don't think I said it yeah but in the four percent body fat video like I did wrestling in seventh grade I did wrestling in eighth grade then I had gym class in ninth grade or not gym but weights so like weightlifting in ninth grade weightlifting in like 10th grade i think too i didn't take it super serious but like you know i did it um and uh i worked out at home for like a couple months or like maybe a month or whatever but genetics and stuff too um i I've always, when I was younger, been pretty skinny and everything. It was only when I started getting a little bit, like, older, like, um, because I'm not even that old, but, like, I was, like, 20, and I just got out of a breakup, and I was working security, so that's, like, one of the only times that, like, I've got, like, pretty big, um, and, like, yeah, I was almost, like, 200 pounds, but at that time, I didn't, like, really have muscle like that. I was just, like, as much muscle as I had when I was, like, 150, but I just put on a lot of fat. And, um, now I'm basically that same weight, but like with muscle and everything. So it's like different. I could show a picture of that too, what I looked like. Um, but when I started working out, I already had been done with that job and I was fasting. So I've been done intermittent fasting for like four years or whatever, just for like health and everything. It didn't have anything to do with, um with working out because I was doing that before I ever worked out and stuff um but I I don't know um I I don't know exactly what body fat percent I was at when I first started like working out for real for real I'd have to check it out on the one because I you know when I started I was 150 then I the first BM body scan that I got it was like 155 and then um then the next one was 165 and I don't know I was like upper 10 percent probably but I cut off a lot of fat pretty fast just like eating healthy I was eating like salmon and macadamia nuts and rice and um avocados and that's basically it <laughs> like I had other shit too but I stuck mostly to that. Then I started eating like eggs because like when I hit 165, I was like, God damn. Uh, I was only at that time working out for like a month and a half, like I said. And 
I was like already down to like four percent body fat, and I was like shredded as fuck, like super toned, like like fucking like pretty crazy. So I was like, damn, <laughs> what do I do now? You know what I mean? Because like I already like achieved this like pretty crazy f physique. Um, so I was like, just maintain or do I go further? You know? And I was like, shit, like I did this in like only like a month and a half, so I'm gonna push for further. And uh, when I pushed for further, bro, that shit was hell, dude. Like, cause like, it was easier to get to like 165 cause I feel like I naturally probably like hold that much, you know, like without even working out too much. Like just if I ate more or whatever, but like, um, no, like I pushed all the way, like a, my max weight was 215, but I was like pretty like, um, like fat you know not like super fat but i was like i never got a body scan around the time that i was that but that was like i wasn't even that weight for too long I, like the highest i was was like 215 then i went down to 205 and that's around where i was at and then even on the scans it doesn't say 205 because that's like kind of more with like water weight it says um 198 i think I, this one doesn't show it but um Yeah, the highest it says is 198.2. Um, but, like, I, I was, like, around the 200 range or whatever. And I was, like, uh, 13, 12% body fat around there. And uh, it, it was just crazy because, like, I went from a 4% body fat up to like, where it says right here is it says 12.5. Which isn't like even that high. I think I hold more fat on my outside because my visceral fat levels have always been really low. Um, which is like the fat on like your organs and shit. So like, I don't know. This is just a guess. Cause like, or maybe those shits are just ass and they're not telling the actual percentages, but I'm like, it doesn't look like I'm like 12% like or some shit or like I would be eight or like four. It'd be like, like I'm saying that when I'm at four, it looks like maybe I'm at like six or like seven or eight or some shit. And being at eight, I'm like, I'm probably like at 12, but, uh, or I look like I am, but, uh, everybody holds fat differently, you know, it's like what I assume and shit. And like, I'm just saying, thinking like, I probably just have like less fat on my organs and it's like more outside on me or some shit. And, um, which is good, I guess, but it means like I could have like a lower body fat percentage and it would show more, I, I don't fucking know, um, that's just an idea, but if I get, like, bigger with all this shit, I could go through and, like, I bet there's ways you can get your fat percentage checked more accurately, I don't, I don't know, uh, so you could let me know, but, yeah, that shit was crazy, bro, getting, um, big from, like, 165, from going from, like, a 4% body fat to, like, the 12, it was, like, 4, 8, 12, like, I three times my body fat, and I was like shredded, you know, so like I fucking felt fat as shit, bro. Uh, and I got like stretch marks and shit too, cause I got like big so quick. I don't know if you can see them. Like right there you could probably, but uh, yeah, I got like stretch marks on like the back of my arm and like on my bicep and shit. Cause um, I got big like hella quick, not just muscle, but fat. Cause I was at a race with my friend to get to 200 pounds and that shit was stupid. Uh, I should have just focused on putting on skeletal muscle mass and like instead of just mass in general. But uh, so I was doing like some crazy shit. I was drinking like calories, smoothies and shit, like fucking like 9,000 calories. I'd take like half jars of peanut butter and like 30 fucking eggs and like just down that shit and like fucking like be like fucking about to puke. I'm like, oh God, <laughs> like rolling in fucking bed and shit, bro. It, I did that shit for months, bro. I was like thinking about it like, <clears throat> I'm about to fucking donate some blood and they'll give me like blood work results or like some shit on like different stuff. I don't know if they tell you if you have like diabetes or not or this or that, but I was like, bro, I hope I did not like fuck myself up, bro. Cause like, I know that that's not some shit that like we're meant to endure. Uh, I feel fine though, but yeah, I don't know. It's just like, I'm never doing that shit again. I'm just going to keep it slow and steady and shit but uh in the end it's pretty cool i put on a lot more muscle and shit um from like 165 it's weird because like i never know how these papers work and shit um 
Because on this paper, they're like, they don't have the paper, so you can't see like everything on this one, as you can see on this one. But this one's the most up-to-date one. This one's like two times before. Um, but it's weird because like, it says at one, I could use this probably. It says when I was at 163.6, which basically like 165. Um, when it was at there, it shows that I had 90 pounds, 90.8 pounds of skeletal muscle. Now I weigh 191 today. And it says I have 100 and like basically two, it's 101.9. Um, <clears throat> so that's like six, 70, 80, 90, that's 30 pounds. 10 of the pounds is, um, let's say, so 12, around 12 of the pounds, like 11 or 12, this is like 12 to make it easier. 12 of the pounds is muscle from the 90 uh which would mean like 20 pounds or not 20 but <laughs> fucking stupid um all right so it's 30 pounds so then it'd be 18 pounds 18 pounds of the weight would be other shit but then i can do this so nine of the pounds is fat because if i had seven pounds of fat right now i have 16 pounds of fat on my whole body so like nine pounds plus like say it's like 12 so that's like 20 like 21 i don't fucking know i'm just doing this in my head but like uh what's the other 10 is what i'm wondering like is the other 10 like water weight is it um i don't fucking know that's what i'm saying i don't understand these things because you would think that i'd be um right now that i would weigh 181 pounds or some shit, but I don't know. I don't know how that shit works. I guess I'm gonna end the video here because I'm just ranting, but yeah, this is just a random video of me just talking kind of shit on my mind. So I'll just name it random or random slash talking about my workout journey or some shit like that. Peace, hope you guys enjoyed it. If you want more shit like this, comment below and I'll just do more videos of me just talking about random shit, but uh, have a good rest of your day and leave a like if you want to a comment if you want to leave video recommendations and uh, support it or appreciate that <laughs> but see you guys